says, when you tell us to figure the crime per 100,000 of the city we live in, I live in a city of 6,667 people. Do I times that by whatever makes it 100,000, then add the crimes up, and times it by the number I times the population by? If I understand that correctly, uh, the answer is yes. Uh, let me demonstrate that uh, briefly. Uh, and I'll write this at the same time. Allow me to demonstrate. Uh, let's look at the newly released 2012 uh, crime data as an example. And then I'm going to post for main uh, with the question. Okay, so it's saying the student in criminology asks. Okay, so if we take a look at some let's screen share. screen share the full screen. Okay, now I'm going to have to subtract that out and we're going to take a look now at one particular town. Okay, so I'm showing this now and I will write this in an email later uh, to everyone in the criminology class. Uh, let's say we have a town with a population that is smaller than 100,000. Uh, Bangor is smaller than 100,000. I just picked that out of a hat. Uh, it has a population of 33,036 according to this screen. So how do we calculate the crimes per 100,000 if Bangor has less than 100,000? Okay, this is how we do it. Step one, start, load up your calculator. Okay, um, so we're going to take, let's take the numbers of aggravated assaults, okay? We're going to try to calculate the rate of aggravated assaults per 100,000 population. Well, let's take 20, if, if we had, let's imagine, exactly one ass aggravated assault for every person in Bangor in a year, that would be 33,036 aggravated assaults. If we divide that by the population, 33,036, we would end up with one. What does that represent? That represents the idea that there is one assault for every person. Actually, fortunately, there are only 23 aggravated assaults per 33,036 people, which means that there is 6.96 times 10 to the negative 4 assaults for uh, every person in, in, in Bangor. Bangor is actually quite safe, or if we multiplied that by 100 to get a percent, it would be 0.07% okay, uh, of the time someone in Bangor is going to get assaulted. Well, now that's hard to talk about, right? There are... 6.96 times 10 to the negative 4 assaults per person in Bangor, which is why crime rates are discussed per 100,000. It's so that we can get past times 10 to the negative 4. So what you actually do is, remember, we got this number by taking 23 and dividing it into 33,036. To get the number per 100,000, you simply multiply by 100,000. Now you have a rate of 69.62 aggravated assaults in Bangor in 2012 per 100,000 population. Okay? So, again, take the actual number of crimes, divide by the population, 
multiply by 100,000, and you should be all set. I hope that helps. Um, I'll actually post this video excerpt uh, to YouTube so that you can work it out yourself. Good luck, uh, and uh, I look forward to seeing your results.